The next chapter is about to unfold and the coming videos will be about Israel and at the moment we are leaving Cyprus uh, to Israel. Enjoy this new video. Okay. So we will replace uh, Jessica and Matthias for Peter and Adaya. <laughs> and there are Peter and Adaya. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Today we sail to Israel so we will prepare the boat a little bit and then uh, we go. Ready klaar for? Yes, let's yeah? go. Yes, let's go. Yalla. Hi. Hello. Half a year ago they also were on the boat, so they exactly know what to do. That's nice. Look at this. Our trip to Israel, it's about 30 hours from here Larnaca to um, Haifa. And we hope to arrive there uh, halfway the day tomorrow. There's a, a little area with uh, some light wind close to Israel. So uh, let's hope the wind stays, uh, stays good. We uh, plan to sail the whole trip, but we're not completely sure. sailing towards Israel and uh, that's a nice feeling. I'm curious for Israel and uh, the sailing is going very very good. We go six knots average and um, we sleep a lot and uh, it's nice. Only Peter is a bit seasick. That's, uh, that's a pity. But, uh, Herman is sleeping now and I'm doing watch and um, we had to change our course quite a bit because there is a, a boat he is towing cables underwater something like that so he said it's dangerous to come close so we had to go a bit around him so now we have to make a detour of an hour but it's all right Wow, it's a really nice evening. It's uh, red and orange colors in the sky. And uh, sailing to Israel, it's a special feeling. It's a country where I have a special feeling with because I'm Christian and the majority of the Bible is uh, happening in Israel. Uh, let's enjoy a nice sail and a good sleep tonight. We've got a fish! <laughs> it looks very, very big. Well, a little bit big. Wow. Kijk je uit? Hè? Ja. Oh ja, wat is dit voor een vis? Het is big. How do we kill this? We blijven weer. Wil je filmen? Wacht even. 
Oh yeah. This is big. Yeah, man. What is it? <laughs> wow. Wow. Oh, oh. Dit is finale, vriend. Wow. Look at this. It's really big. <laughs> and beautiful. Okay, let's uh, make it uh, ready for the fridge because he's a little bit seasick, so he doesn't uh, enjoy fish at the moment. And Thank you, sir. What is that? This is in it. What are you doing? I'm, I'm, I'm talking to the Israeli Navy and they, it's, it takes half an hour. November, Mike, Lima, Kilo, 9, Juliet, Foxtrot, over. Look at that. The fish was ju is just jumping out of the water. But... Uh, we are fishing at the moment as well, but they don't bite our little fish. So, what is the plan? Uh, even swimmen. Lekker. Okay. Yes, this is the messenger. Israeli Navy, go ahead. Het <laughs> is heel lekker. Het is heel lekker, hè? Ja. En het water is blauw. Ah, God, zit daar in de poep die man. Ah. De poep die man, de poep. Ah. Hey. Oh, what is happening? <laughs> <laughs> Lekker Pieter! Maar ze waren al in het water. Ja. Yeah. Messenger, this is Navy. <laughs> 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 I mean, uh, it's going far to make some good footage. Our speed decreased quite a bit, so we are only going like one and a half or two knots, I think. Iedereen springt overboord. They just leave me. Alone on the boat. I hope there's coming some wind. Then they are lost. So, the wind is almost gone and uh, it will come back in uh, maybe two or three hours. So we uh, enjoy our time all around this ocean. Wait. Come on, boy. He's going a little further away. And is it lekker? Yeah. <laughs> this is exactly the right moment to answer one of your questions. The secret that everyone wants to know. What about the money? Yeah, um, the first and most important thing is uh, not to spend too much. So you just saw us floating around for a few hours waiting for the wind. This is one of the things we do to uh, try to keep our expenses low. Yeah, most sailors would start the engine. Yeah, as an example, we spent 660 euros so far on uh, petrol from the Netherlands to here. So, um, yeah, and besides that, uh, we also cook on the boat, we avoid uh, marinas and that kind of thing. So we try not to spend more money than necessary. And the second thing is uh, that we had some savings. So before we saved some money and uh, we try to uh, go with that as long as possible and sometimes we have a little job in the Netherlands or on the way to uh, to earn some more 
And the third point is that there are a few people that asked us if they could support us because they liked what we were, were doing. So, um, yeah, a few people are doing that and we are Thank thankful for that. Thank you very much for that. Yes. And lately we uh, did a calculation about how much money we spent on one day together, including everything, all costs. And I think I can, I can say it, right? Yeah. It's uh, about 18 euros a day for everything, including all costs, insurance, boat maintenance, food, marina cost, everything. This is how we do it financially in short. Uh, thank you very much Bernardine for this question and if you have any other question please feel free to ask under this video or on sailingmessenger at gmail.com and now back to the video. So, uh, yes, Israeli Navy, this is the messenger. Could you please repeat the previous part before uh, Lanaka? Uh, Saint Raphael in uh, Cyprus. Copy that, thank you very much. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you for uh, the nice run. Back to 16, yeah, it's finished. They are in war with uh, several countries yes. around, so they have to they yes. have to check this and they have to be very sure about what is coming in. So, just before dark we sail into Haifa, the first uh, marina we do in Israel. And the port control is uh, guiding us in so uh, it's, uh, it's going all smooth and according to the plan a little bit later than the plan So we are in Israel and they checked us for about an hour, they wanted to know everything, why this stamp in your passport, why that, and uh, Too much questions. a lot of questions, and now they gave us permission, a restricted permission to go into the country, because we cannot go to another country, so we cannot go to, into Palestine, we cannot go close to the border, and we can stay for one month, so we get a visa for one month. Besides the restrictions, we are just allowed to enter. And that's nice. And now we prepare the barbecue. Look at this. <laughs> we are looking forward to Israel. It is on a religious level a very interesting country. And uh, politically it's a very complicated situation. And they say that even the nature is very very beautiful. Well. Thank you for watching this video and see you in two weeks.